Back with the head coach of the Pioneers, Tom Hogan, and coach uh, talked a lot this week about capitalizing on the momentum you generated last week in New York. Good week of practice, and I would imagine coming out of this one, there's always stuff to work on, but you got to be pretty pleased with this win. Yeah, I, I was. I think we, we started out a little bit slow in the first set, um, but following that, I think we really executed our systems really well and executed our strategy really well. Uh, you know, we, we definitely had a lot of unforced errors early, um, but as soon as we cleaned that up and we started to play uh, DU offense and, and we started to do DU blocking, it, it you know, really worked out well for us. You said last weekend playing better as the weekend went along was right. a big key. You played better, it seemed like, as the night went along tonight. I mean, from yeah. where you were in the first set to set number three, what does that do for you, your mentality as a staff, going into tomorrow night against Georgetown with that improvement? Yeah, and it's kind of the same thing. You know, we look to play better against Georgetown. They're an extremely physical team, and we hope that our, our game keeps improving as well. But, yeah, I was really proud with the, the way our team kind of bounced back after that first set um, and really cleaned up our game and our side. Um, but yeah, tomorrow we look to just improve um, from where we left off today and do kind of the same thing that you mentioned that we did last week and just improve within every match. Quick turnaround. I mean, obviously, they're familiar with this, your team from last weekend, and, and knowing that that's going to be a case going forward. But what's the message to them tonight and especially, you know, getting right back after it 24 hours later? Right. You know, in the middle of the court there, I just kind of told them to make sure they take care of their bodies and they get the proper treatment, they get a good night's rest, and... Tomorrow we're going to look at film on Georgetown and we're going to prepare for them. So it's going to be a long day. Um, and so a lot of it is just, you know, sleep and recovery um, for our team. And if we can do that, then, you know, we've got a good shot tomorrow. But Georgetown, again, is an extremely good team, very physical, very aggressive, and they're well coached. So we've got a, a big challenge for us tomorrow. You mentioned that before the game today, Southern Utah, a lot more of a kind of a tactically oriented team, yeah. whereas Georgetown is an athleticism oriented team. Yeah. What kind of challenges does that present to take two totally different styles right, right in such you know close order back to back? Absolutely, yeah. Um, we'll really have to turn our, our mindset around a little bit um, and get ready for a team that's gonna be you know extremely physical, very aggressive, very offensive. Um, at the net so we will we will have to have our serve cleaned up we'll have to attack them with that um, and we'll have to you know be ready to play some good defense tomorrow um, but I, I, I do like how we did progress uh, through the match and uh, we left ourselves in a good spot in preparation for tomorrow Tom Hogan the head coach of the Pioneers you said uh, sleep and taking care of the body are the important <laughs> things for tomorrow so absolutely go get some. yeah thank you congratulations okay